Welcome to my workbench. And it looks like a horrible mess, I know, but it is progress. Lots and lots of progress here. I am working on a channel strip, which will be one channel of Mike Pre. And rather than having a second channel, uh, there will be a compressor, which is based on the LA-2A. Very, very famous compressor. Opto compressor, tube compressor. And then down here, I have an EQ circuit that I've been working on with Carn Hill inductors and Teflon capacitors, paper and oil capacitors. Um, here's a little sample of what this sounds like. Now, first, I'm just running it through the compressor, and I love this LA-2A compressor. And I also modified the circuit of the LA-2A. Instead of using a 12AX7, I like a 12AY7 because it has a, a softer characteristic. 12AX7s are really good for guitar amps and stuff, but they are not very forgiving when they get overdriven. Whereas a 12AY7 was actually designed as a microphone preamplifier tube, and it sounds great. So I'm going to let you hear Sally Berry sing through this. And you'll see that it's pegging down about 5 dB of gain reduction, and that meter is spot on. It is exactly right. So if you see it compressing 5 dB, it is compressing 5 dB. Ever since the day that we parted, I've been so sad and so blue. I'm always thinking of you, love, and I just can't quit drinking that old booze. I'm just driving nails in my coffin every time I drink a bottle of booze. I'm just driving nails in my coffin, driving those nails over you. So there you have it. That is a incredible compressor. You won't find any software that sounds like that. Nothing compresses like that. Like a hardware LA-2A, especially one that's been modified a little bit. Now for the EQ, I'm going to go ahead and help out a ribbon microphone. Everybody knows that ribbon mics can sound a little dull on top. And so I'm using a high shelf boost of 8 dB. It's hard to see, but it's in the fourth position. These go in 2 dB steps, so it's in the fourth position, a high shelf. And then I'm rolling off just a little bit. Looks like I'm rolling down two steps, so 4 dB on the very low frequencies. And the mid-range stays the same. And so here's what that sounds like on my vocal. My sweetheart is gone and I'm so lonely She said that she and I were through I started out drinking for pastime Driving nails in my coffin over you I'm just driving nails in my coffin Every time I drink a bottle of booze I'm just driving nails in my coffin Driving those nails over you All right, so you can hear it's a really nice sounding high shelf and just a little bit of the lows rolled off on it. And, uh, of course, when it was recorded, I used the 270 hertz low shelf, which kind of smooths things down a little bit, but not nearly as much as what this EQ circuit does. So, so I am in development phase, and I'll keep everybody posted as things go along. Good night.